you going to be on camera, in front of the camera? No, I'm just going to talk to you guys. But I, I just want a record of it so people know um, that I was here. Okay, so you, are you filming now? Yes. All right, so Mark, get set, go, and, and, then, and just let it be known that this is a uh, pioneer coming into view task force. These are volunteers who are helping with our coming into view capital campaign. This is not the Pioneer Public Television Board of Directors. It's not the Community Advisory Board. These people are here as volunteers to help us raise funds for uh, to continue our mission. So go ahead, Alan. Thank you very much, uh, Madam Chairman uh, and Committee Board, whatever your titles are. I, I'm dropping off for you a Gambling Control Board uh, meeting that I was at in November that uh, uh, got into the accounting and taxation of our Minnesota charities that are involved with poll tabs. That includes BFW clubs, Eagles, Elks, Lions, and, and so on. And uh, uh, you do your legislature, and I would like to be involved in a, uh, a couple of programs of a preview to your legislate, le legislature, and because the, the legislature set up a thing to pay for uh, the Viking Stadium, and the people have a right to see what really came out of that. Now that, I would like to be on the Minnesota Channel, uh, all over the state of Minnesota to show what is taking place with gaming in the state of Minnesota and the taxation rate. And some of you got the, a sheet in front of you that shows that uh, the net profits for gambling in fiscal 2018 in the state of Minnesota for these charities, these nonprofit charities, was $157.5 million. $157 million. And the uh, charities themselves, of their profit, they were only able to keep 70 million of it. 75 million of it went to state income tax. And anything above 36.9 million goes to pay off stadium bonds, U.S. Bank stadium bonds. And maybe you caught uh, recently where Fox 9 and KSDP kind of well, Fox actually said we're going to pay off this stadium early. Well, if you look at this outrageous tax rate that we're charging our nonprofit uh, uh, charities in the state of Minnesota, it's pretty easy to pay it off early. Now, I want you to also remember when it comes to taxation, no one, no corporation or the richest individual pays more than a 9.8% uh, income tax. This is over a 50% income tax, tax and fees to our local charities. And I would like to be on the Minnesota Channel with Les or whoever or the people at TPTV and play this uh, uh, half hour video of questioning the, the Gambling Control Board and then talk about the economics of it and what goes on. And uh, when we have, you go to the, the the back sheet, or the middle sheet, I should say, uh, Merrick uh, yeah, <laughs> Incorporated paid over 81% of their net profit this past year to state income tax and fees, and no one's talking about it. Why? Because they don't want any independent person to talk about it. And that's the purpose of informed TV and radio. And then there's a sheet here relating in, in red and, and purple that I'd also like to be a guest on the Minnesota channel to talk about uh, the Farm Bill. I presented this to all the universities. I presented in hand to uh, the Secretary of Agriculture himself. That's an option to uh, get people, or uh, the farm policy away from subsidies because I sold Tip O'Neill uh, farm policy with the help of Chuck Canton, uh, the only farm policy that stood the test of time without subsidies. And then I'm a felon when I took on the system. And I would like to talk about what a felon faces uh, in life in general as well as trying to get uh, a TV uh, network going so common people are informed. And that's what I'm here today for. I left you this uh, uh, DVD. I left you information. I want to be on the Minnesota Channel, because that's what is there, to serve the public, and the public needs to be informed, 
as well as a special session of your legislature to see what your legislators did to the charities of Minnesota to make sure that U.S. Bank Stadium bond, uh, Stadium would be paid for, not on taxpayers, but on the backs of charities. Thank you very much for giving me time, and I left you guys a $100 bill uh, on my credit card, so I paid for my time here as well. Thank you very much. Thank you.